Kate Winslet is sounding off about the Ozempic craze. Kate, who was once a target for tabloids when it came to her weight, is sharing what she really thinks about the Ozempic weight loss trend in Hollywood and beyond. In an interview with the New York Times Magazine published on March 3rd, Kate says, quote, I actually don't know what Ozempic is. All I know is that it's some pill that people are taking or something like that. After learning more about the diabetes drug during the interview, which is an injection that has become a trend for weight loss, the 48-year-old gives her honest reaction. Oh my god, Kate remarks, this sounds terrible. The Oscar winner goes on to admit that she had developed an eating disorder at the height of her popularity after the release of Titanic. She tells the outlet, quote, I never told anyone about it. Because guess what? People in the world around you go, Hey, you look great. You lost weight. So even the compliment about looking good is connected to weight. And that is one thing I will not let people talk about. If they do, I pull them up straight away. And Kate's rise to fame eventually made her a major target for tabloids, which often focused on her appearance. In February of 2021, she tells The Guardian, quote, It was almost laughable how shocking, how critical, how straight-up cruel tabloid journalists were to me. She adds, I was still figuring out who the hell I bloody well was. They would comment on my size. They'd estimate what I weighed. They'd print the supposed diet I was on. It was critical and horrible and so upsetting to read. Well, looking back at the comments and criticism about her body, Kate confesses that she would have handled it differently if she could do it over again, explaining on the Happy, Sad, Confused podcast in December 2022, quote, I would have said, don't you dare treat me like this. I'm a young woman. My body is changing. I'm figuring it out. I'm deeply insecure. I'm terrified. Don't make this any harder than it already is. This nonsense on commenting on bodies and how women look, it's getting better, but we've still got such a ways to go. 